Love Island viewers have called out the show for staging the moment the female Islanders learned about Katie McDermott's arrival. As the boys were in the villa getting to know the bombshell, who starred in Series 2, Tyreek Hyde suggested they all take a snap to send to the girls to reveal Katie. When the segment cut to the girls, Ella Thomas suggested they do the exact same thing, although her phone alerted her she had a text message with the image. But fans were unimpressed with Katie's grand reveal as they called out the scripted moment. At the Aries said, can the producers at least try and pretend it's not scripted please, because are we really supposed to believe that the girls plan to text a picture to the guys just as they sent one of them and Katie? At Turnkey is added, the selfie clips next to each other oh my god this is not real. Like that was planned? Sick? At James Cayley 2398 commented, it won't stop me from watching the show but the boys shall we get a selfie and the girls reaction to it, the text suddenly goes when they take a selfie, sick, plan much. Sick, Oj Toba 01 tweeted, that selfie was planned by management. At Sarah HC 2606 said, how staged was the scene when the girls were about to send a selfie when the boys did, sick, phony. Don't miss. Katie McDermott sex breaks silence as she returns to Love Island, ITV, Love Island star shares villa rules including toilet requests, insight, how to watch Love Island season 10 on ITVX from UK, USA, or anywhere, Love Island, Maria fumed. This couldn't be more staged, sick, at least let us think they didn't know about Katie. Katie was first on the show back in 2016 when Love Island had its second season. The 27-year-old was coupled up with Scott Thomas, who she finished the competition in third place with. Although after a year together the duo split and she's not on the lookout for love once again. Ahead of entering the villa, Katie said, I think I'm known from season 2 for being so chaotic. People always ask, do you have regrets? Expecting me to say yes, but I was so true to myself and I was 100% authentic. I'll still be like that now, but 7 years on, I am more mature. I'm still the fiery pocket rocket but I know what I want and what I don't want. Don't get me wrong, I'm still going to be me and the fire I have is in my soul, I'll never get rid of that and I love that about me, but I'm a lot more emotionally mature now, so I know how to navigate things better. I've grown up a lot. Last time I got with Scott straight away and I was so tunnel vision. It'll be interesting to see what connections I'll form this time. Love Island continues on weekdays on ITV2 from 9pm. Melting